What's up, friends and family out in YouTube world? It's your fellow alopecia princess, Jacqueline Hill Bennett. Thank you for tuning in. Okay, so tonight, um, real fast, uh, life update and new hair. I uh, got my, uh, I took advantage of the wigs.com um, half off promotion on Louis Fair wigs and I got myself another Soho Chic, of course, because I love that wig. And the last one, after about four months, it started to get kind of ratty, so I had to replace it, which is good because um, when I had my Soho Chic wig last time, I did not know the exact color that I bought, and now I know it is a number eight. Um, there it is. Uh, so before I even get into the wig, I did miscarry the baby. Um, I don't know if you saw the last video, but yeah, I was pregnant for five weeks and about two weeks ago I found out about it and it just threw my whole life in a loop because I was miscarrying already by the time I learned that I was pregnant. Um, I've chosen not to be sad anymore. I spent the past two weeks being sad because I had just been bleeding for the entire time that I was pregnant and um, confused because the doctors kept giving me this false sense of hope that I was going to have the baby and um, despite the bleeding. <laughs> so Anyway, I am still miscarrying today. I uh, still have the bloated belly and um, lots of bleeding, but um, I've chosen, you know, not to be sad anymore. I spent enough time being sad and I owe it to myself to move on and live my life. So that's what I'm going to do. All right. So, Louis Fair. Let's get right into it. Ooh, I got it. It took about five days to come in the mail, which is cool, and it comes with bunch of little stuff in the box oh new Louis fair wigs I have to check those out all right we have like one more day till the end of the month so I guess tomorrow's the last day I'll be able to order if I decide that I love any of these wigs so let's see I'll check it out yeah I held on to this I did not open it until I got here for you guys I wanted to do this with you with my friends and YouTube bro my family okay so there she is um, I just really just wanted to do this unboxing with you guys so um, you could see just I remember telling you guys that um, I was able to basically just pull this wig out of the box and wear it, but um, to be honest, I've never actually done that. If I did, I don't remember, so it's good that we get to do this together. Got my scissor, so I could snip off the tag. And I couldn't wait to get another synthetic unit because human hair wigs are hard to manage. This this wig that I'm wearing is giving me headaches. So I can't wait to get my skin back on another synthetic, high-end synthetic wig. Oh, they left some of the the um lace on, so I have to cut that. I don't remember doing that last time, but I guess I did. So yeah, even though this wig gave me problems, I am happy with it today. What I did was I um, I straightened it out just a little bit. I wanted to have I wanted the wig to have some texture and at the same time be straight rather than wavy. 
the wavy thing just was not working out for me so I had to like undo that <laughs> not bad though I'm not disappointed with how it looks when it is a little straighter okay let's go right in with Soho Chic okay right away you see <laughs> I did not just pull that straight out the box and make it work but I'm sure it's probably just a matter of blow drying which I'm not going to do right now because it's quite late but in my next video I will show you guys how it looks in all my videos I mean like I've made like five or six how to you know train the front of your unit wig um, videos so I'm not going to do that this time I'm just going to show you how it comes out at the end um, I've actually worn this wig on camera before once it's been styled so it's you know you already know what it's going to look like I just wanted to unbox it and show you the color try to get that color in the light for you this color is great it is the perfect blend of dark without being too dark. I like that. Okay, so this is what, for now, we'll just do this, which I would never wear out on the street. But for now, I'm just showing you what this wig looks like. If you do absolutely nothing to it, but throw it on and comb it, which I would never do, by the way. Do not recommend that. If you want to look like something special, please do more to your wig than just throw it on. But Yeah, I still love this wig a lot. I'm happy with it. Great bounce to it. The perfect luster, not too shiny and not dull at all. <laughs> I love once I get this thing blown out you guys ain't gonna be able to touch the girl <laughs> I'm silly okay so since I decided not to be sad anymore I finally plugged in the TV at mom and dad's house um, I brought my TV from my house plugged it in and uh, decided to check tidy up the room a little bit it's hard living in this tiny room with my husband and all our things are here because we are not allowed to keep anything at our house during the renovation so yeah that's just my little life update thank you for watching guys and thank you for being there for me if you um saw my last video and you saw how devastated i was about um what I thought to be a miscarriage and later learned was actually a miscarriage and you said something nice I, I I received some of the most thoughtful and and heartfelt um messages based on that and I thank you guys for that so I'll see you again soon and this is Soho Chic by Louise Fair Next time I see you, I will have this all styles and I'll be looking dope. But I'm happy with it. Go and buy yourself Louis Fair wig. They're not bad at all. Where's my comb? Here we go. That's a nice deep part. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. Moves all over. Could part it on any side. Yeah, I'm going to enjoy this just like I enjoyed it last time. Thanks for watching.